In this video, I will teach you how to use Close Deletion and the other options in Anki. Close Deletion is a process of hiding one or more words in a sentence. It's like filling in the blanks. For example, you are learning English past tense. Let's look at this example. You will see the present word eat and you must change it to past tense. So we will write eight. Let's go to Anki. First, let's create a deck. Let's call it English. Under English deck, let's put a sub deck which is called past tense because we will learn English past tense. By making a sub deck, write the main deck you want to put the sub deck. Then write two columns and then the name of the sub deck. Let's open the past tense deck. Let's add a card. Click the type at the top and choose close. Let's write this sentence. I ate a lot of food at the party yesterday. Let's select this 8 because this will be our question. We will click these three dots or just do its shortcut Control shift c The word 8 change. Let's see how it looks. So as you can see, the word 8 is gone and it's like blank now. But the problem is we don't know what the word is. Maybe it is throw or buy. I bought a lot of food at the party yesterday. I threw a lot of food at the party yesterday. So let's write the present tense of the word. Let's go to edit. Let's add the word eat next to the eight by writing two columns first and the word eat. You can style it also. Me, I like when the question is red and the answer is blue. Let's change the color by clicking this button above. Let's make it bold. Now we know what is the word we need to answer. In this case, you need to think about what is the answer and click show answer to see if you are correct. But let's do it differently. I really want to type the answer. So let's go again to edit, cards, copy this closed text, and in paste, and write the word type, column, at the beginning, and copy this, and go to back template, and paste it below and save now we can type our answer let's write 8 if it's all green then it means it's all correct let's write a wrong answer this time for you to see what it looks like if it's not correct let's add e at the end so you can see that there is red now it means that what you added is wrong and you will see the correct answer below. Now you can add more cards using Close Deletion. You can add some images in your card also. Let's create a deck again and let's call it Images. Let's open the deck, add, and this time it will be basic. We will not use Close. Let's go to Fields. Let's add Image Field. Save. Now we added the image field, but we want it to be top. So let's go back again to fields and click reposition and write one. I don't need the front, so I'll delete it. Save. Now the image field is on the top. Now let's add an image by clicking this icon. Let's write the answer at the back field. Let's add. Let's see how it looks. It shows that the front of this card is blank. Why is that? Let's see why. Let's go to edit. Go to cards and write the image field that we just added. You can see the preview on the right side also. Let's save. Ta-da! Now we can see the image. 
but the image is too big so let's reduce the size again edit cards go to styling put here img for image let's put 100 pixel width hmm. or maybe 500 pixel i think 100 pixel is too small let's save now our image is adjusted but i want to type the answer again so go to edit again cards go to back template copy the back because this is where our answer is written then paste it in the front template and write type and then save now we can type the answer you also have other options in Anki like stats you will see here all your statistics here in tools, you can add add-ons. You will paste the code of the add-on here. For example, heat map add-on. Let's paste this code. It shows that we need to restart Anki, so let's close it and open it again. This is a heat map add-on. You will see your number of cards reviewed every day. There are more add-ons out there so you can explore some of them. So that is all for now. I think it is enough information for you to start using Anki better. Please don't forget to subscribe and click the notification bell because there are still a lot of things I want to share with you. Follow me on my Instagram, Facebook, and TikTok.